Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us. There are new developments in the case of a female body found in Octobaha County Sunday. Our Cash Matt Locks talked to the Sheriff's Department and has the latest on the investigation. At 6.45 a.m. Sunday, deputies with the Octibaha County Sheriff's Department responded to a call on Townsend Road near Rock Hill Road. There, they found the body of a woman. We've identified the um, female victim as Kimberly Belk, uh, 40 years of age, from Ware, Mississippi. Sheriff Steve Gladney says a pedestrian who was walking along the road Sunday morning found Belk's body. It was a person that lived on that on that road was just out walking that morning and just happened to walk up on him and uh, left in and called 911. Gladney says the incident must have happened sometime after midnight on Saturday and as of right now no witnesses have stepped forward with any information. Well, it's being treated as a death investigation right now again you know we just we hadn't even done the autopsy. The autopsy hadn't and, and it might be you know a day or so before that even happened so. And there are currently no suspects in the case. You know this is early stages of this investigation and you know and and like any investigation, the rumors are, are, are going everywhere, you know, with this. So, you know, we don't want to speculate on anything or talk about anything until we know, but uh, we're just asking for help, you know, from the community. The sheriff also says Townsend Road, the scene of the incident, is not traveled often. It, and it's a dead end road, and there's only a few houses on it, you know, uh, and it, like I said, it's a dead end, so. And as far as why Belk was in this area at this time, is also uncertain. We had heard that she was staying with a friend here in town. Uh, so, but again, you know, that's just uh, things that we're picking up on. So, in Octobaha County, Cash Matlock, WCBI News. And the sheriff is asking anyone in the community who may have any information on this case to please contact Golden Triangle Crime Stoppers or the Octobaha County Sheriff's Department. We will have more information on the investigation as it develops. Meanwhile, Kimberly